Now, would you look at that? Oh, I knew I'd seen someone scrambling in the mountains. Bet what you brings you here, my sir? Uh, that, yeah, that's a long story. Who am I? Finn Deliris, apothecarius by my path. Pleased to meet you. And you are at Sun Coast, in the south of Enderal. Where are you from? You my uh, but attacks, wait, yes. don't tell me. I know that accent. Nerim, isn't it? Nerim. I... That's the mod from Bleeding, isn't it? Everything's locked up. At least for the night we should. Oh, I can't wait a sec. Who's that? <sighs> Just an adventurer on his way. No reason to worry. A quick kick no quick reason quick to worry? For heck's sake, Finn. How do you know that this guy is with the bandits? Sake, you said you'd call me if anyone showed up. And now you're... You're standing here, having a chat with him, as if this were the bathing house of Ark. Lo and behold, we are still alive. <laughs> now, is there anything else, Carbos? Make a convincing argument. I've got my eye on you. Touch any of our stuff, and you'll regret it. <sighs> to be fair, I was trying to rob you. <sighs> May I present we'll Carbos as he lives and breathes. Violence, right? Sorry about that just now. That's just how he is. I would be the same. In probably. any case, if you don't need any more help, I'd suggest you move on. Follow the way east behind the dam house. It'll PIs. lead you to a village called uh, Riverville. Ah, Riverville. here, take this. Truth be told, you don't look so healthy. Your eyes. <laughs> ah, well, whatever. Is it vampirism? What about my eyes? Hmm. There's something mm, peculiar about you. I don't know how else to say it. I would examine you myself, but we don't have the right it? equipment with us. So if I were you, I'd ask a priest in Riverville to have a look at you. Who knows? Just... Maybe you caught something in that temple. Or do I only... Is it only showing up because I have a taxi? Yeah? That'd be kind of cool. <laughs> us? Oh, nothing spectacular, I'm afraid. We gather herbs, but tomorrow we're going back north to League. <sighs> you should What's stop by league? one day if you're in the area. Someone who scours period ruins and survives could surely be useful to the apothecary and help us find some things. Maybe. Tell me more well, about this. What can I tell you? This is the Sun Coast in the south of Enter. And, okay. well, that's pretty much it. I think you should ask the people in Riverville if you want to know more. They certainly have some stories oh. to tell. Okay, so it's actually a quest and you get XP from it. Neat. So was that like a speech check or something? It must have been. To an adventurer? Yeah. <laughs> if you ask me, what you need before you adventure anywhere is some good old-fashioned shut eye. That but be yes, nice. there are some places. River the Three River Watch, for example. Right, it's it was once an old trading post, but now it's full of ooh, shady, shady characters. characters. Ah, and there's also a big Pyrian ruin south of us. I'm not going to remember any of this. Oh, never knowledge. <laughs> By the Black Guardian. You really are an outlander, aren't you? My path is... Well, it, it's just me path. What does that mean? My role designated to me by Malthus. A kind okay. of calling, if you will. So how do you know that was your calling? Uh, not exactly. Malthus designates our place in society, oh. generally the same one our fathers and forefathers oh, occupied. Okay. I walk the path of the Erudites, and there's also the Manufacturers, the Sublimes, and, of course, the Pathless. Within these rules, we are free to choose a profession, but certain vocations that are available to an Erudite are not permitted to a Manufacturer. Right. Which is one path below. However, below does not mean that it is in any way inferior. Everyone on Enderal does what they do best. And who would know inferior. better than the gods what exactly that is? Yes. Sure. Um. In 
the folly of my youth, I might have yeah. thought about it, yes. But then I realised that half of what goes wrong in this world has to do with the desire to advance. That is a good I point. I am interested in living the righteous path and to contribute to the preservation of my people. That's enough for me. And only the faithful will be granted the eternal paths upon death. No more power to you, mate. The, I'm guessing I'm Men or women who have never this. received the path consecration, or those who have broken their path. Brigands, glimmer dust smugglers, glimmer dust murderers. Well, you know. Right. Nerium. Is that what, that's what they meant for <laughs> And over here, there's a rumor that the Golden Queen has a weakness for men in gowns. Seriously, be careful with that kind of gossip. I know you don't mean any harm, but there are a few who might consider it heresy. So you guys believe the gods are actually alive, then? Interesting. Maybe. But if I look at other countries, even within the civilized world, it's hard to find a people as peaceful as ours. Well, oh, considering the other guys had slaves and shit, that does make sense. Hmm, yeah, why not? Show me what you've got. Let's see. Maybe I have some things you can use. I made some of our garbage. Right. Um. How much money do I have? Is that my money? Oh no, that's Finn's money. That's annoying. That should be the other way around. It's going to annoy me infinitely. Right. We don't need five pickaxes. Um, keep all of that. Keep all of that. Um, so they're not even worth that much. We may as well keep them. And let's get rid of some of our crap. Clutter. Clutter, clutter, clutter. This is listed by clutter. So I've got a mod um, built onto Sky UI that makes the journal and that look like this. Look like nice and rustic. Oh, so the ancient coins are actually worth more modern coins, I guess. Then. Right. I've got a bunch of ingots too. A bunch of tools. Anything else we don't need? Not really, we kinda kinda wanna keep the rest of it. Alright, what do you have, Finn? Don't need pickaxes. I might grab some potions. Um They seem to just like be scattered around everywhere, so I'm not that desperate to buy them outright right now. That's all the crap that I sold to you. Uh, I don't think I need anything from you. Although I will I will grab one of these potions. Which is all of my money. Don't mention it. I friend. wish you a quick recovery and safe roads. Walk blessed. I'll do my best. Carbos, do we need this still tomorrow? Or can I clean all the tool? Place is Finn, I'm playing. Don't bother me. <sighs> I guess that means no. Where can I sprint? Oh dear, what did I just do? Oh, I had walk toggled on with caps lock. Is that because I click caps lock? No. Okay, that was weird. What's supposed mm -hmm. to happen? By the righteous path! No. What happened to you? You look as if you've met the Black Guardian himself. Um. Fever? Fever. Well, um. <laughs> there could be many causes. Didn't he really Wait a moment. This? I think I still have some grunt root. Grunt root. That should be enough to ease your pain. At it's least for now. Here, is it? Take a seat at the fire. So the warmth that, um, might help you. Other thing. Arcane. Oh, so now we're brewing potions for complete strangers. Well, if the strangers are about to die of fever, then yes. There was that oath we swore once, remember? <laughs> to help the afflicted, to...
whatever. Thank you. That's your problem. Don't get on my nerves. I'm trying not to. God, I'm seeing bloody double. Can I take this without you guys getting pissed? Yes. It's mead. Let me just raid everything you own. Can't sleep. Alright. Is that everything? Can I use this? That would be nice. Trick with that one. Okay, I won't let me interact. Take a seat something. in the fire. The warmth might help you. Yeah, mm, Gruntroots, Gruntroots. Ah, here we go. Nice and comfy. Waiting for him to make it. I can't so get back up. let's see. Sheer cap, some water. Ha! Done. I can't make any promises, Shit. but. Finn, the still. Do something, damn it! Do something! Oh no! What the hell? Oh, Please, sod it. Finn, do I really have to watch every step you take? That was a fucking close call. Not just... Uh, hey, I'm sorry, all right. I'm so confused. We'll pick up a new one in Ark. Oh, did he yeah. blow up his em Alembic, Alembic or whatever it's called? Here I thought his alchemy kit. Day couldn't get any worse. That's insane. Is that something I can <sighs> do if I do alchemy? This day isn't getting any better. Here, drink this. It, yes. See? You already look a lot better. Still, you should let a priest take a look at that fever as soon as possible. Oh, the so growth root portion will wane in a few days. Oh, that's freaking cool. What? Dude, you mean the happened? still? Bad quality. And too much heat, I'd wager. But, eh, whatever will be, will be. Uh. Explosion. Right, I'm not sure I'll follow. Oh, that'd be great, oh. wouldn't it? Finn Dalleries. Died in 8234. Cause of death, exploding still. Ha ha. Look, I really don't know what you're talking about. Maybe... Wait a second. What was that? Okay, so they didn't see that. So it's gotta be to do with my vampirism fever thing. I could have sworn I saw something moving. Was a skeleton over there that I killed? Oh shit! Ah. Oh, what the? Carbos! They've hit me, Finn. Those bastards! Oh shit! They've hit me. Puffy carries. You can heal him, right? Carbos, I do something, damn it! Can I take that red <laughs> off? No. Oh crap! That's good. Uh, now look at that. Our mysterious survivor has awoken. Uh. Jaspar Matumiel Delveric. Jaspar for short. Jaspar. And you, my friend, are at my very own campsite. Friends with Demo from, ask, the, from yes, the, the bandits killed both of the apothecary. Oh. The only reason you're still alive is that the impact of the explosion threw you right into the thicket. Most of your injuries are only superficial, but your fever. It's a different story. Wait, were you I was on the perimeter, this? and no, I didn't help for two reasons. One, I was outnumbered. Two, I'm quite fond of my entrails. Well, fair enough. I, I wish guess. I had a more heroic answer, but I don't. Sorry. Appreciate your honesty. You Why know about not, my actually. vampirism. You're suffering from arcanist's fever. Arcanist's Honestly, fever. I'm surprised the old apothecaries didn't see that. Let me guess, you're suddenly capable of doing things you previously knew only from the bard songs, right? You're uh, unusually guess. strong, you have reflexes like a cat, and drinking potions or any kind of magically infused substance leaves a bitter afterglow in your head. Sounds about right. Well then, congratulations. Your magical talent just blossomed. A bit late, given your age, but it happens. Hey, but simply, the fever the is battle. a result of your body not being able to cope with it. It's not much of a problem for now, but if you don't let an arcanist treat you sometime soon, things are going to get grim. So the 
can and king, see. not curate. From here on out, you're always going to be a little more sensitive than someone without magical gifts. But that's tolerable compared to what your magic will it's allow like you to do. Like being a Breton in Skyrim lore. Wait, no, the opposite of a Breton. High elf, I guess. Um, no knowledge. Prone to certain conditions. As I said, your fever will get worse if you drink healing potions. But you'll also be a lot more susceptible to nightmares and those kinds of things. Also, you should be very cautious of areas with magical contamination, such as Thalgard in the east. Oh, that's what that crystal chamber was that we got the magic gear from at the start. Magically infused stones or whatever they're called. Um... What are At the first, consequences? Diffuse headaches, general unease. Later on, your eyesight will blur, your so limbs will grow weak, before. and you get a maddening itch all over your body. If you leave it untreated for too long, you'll either die or turn into an orbaya. Orbaya? What's an orbaya? Yes, it can kill you. Everything has its price, as the wise hermit likes to say. I've never and an heard orbaya anything is that. basically a giant undead version of yourself with. Tumors and pus all over your body. Oh good, I never look forward to having to fight those everywhere. Well, there's ambrosia, but for an uncontained fever, it will only postpone the symptoms. So what exactly does contain Later, you can it drink means. it whenever the fever gets worse. The stuff looks and tastes like undead sweat, and is bloody expensive, but it's the only thing that really helps. Great. So now I've got to be addicted to ambrosia for the rest of my life. And you have visions. Visions? Well, you said that it amplifies dreams or something, didn't you? Um. Um. Not that I know of. Oh. The only visions I've ever had are those that come along with a good pipe of peace weed. Peace weed. Hmm. <laughs> okay. You know what? As I said, someone needs to contain your fever as soon as possible. And as it happens, I know people. But Can in return, I want you to tell me everything. What did you do in that temple? And what's the story with those visions? Can do. I can't put my finger on it, but there's something strange about you. Maybe and that other than me. having premonitions of the future. Sure. Well then, the stage is yours. Hmm. I see. My condolences for your loss. My oh, the guy I was so, stole it. Let me summarize. You somehow survived getting Didn't thrown like into the open sea, that well, to be honest. and while you were half dead, had this dream in which you saw burnt bodies and a blinding light? Well, like a Templar saw the same one in the valley. Huh. Interesting. And you also said that your magic didn't develop gradually, as it usually does, but all at once, right? Yes. Well, that's quite the story. I guess you know how absurd it sounds, but for some reason, I believe you. I've met a lot of liars in my life, and you aren't and one of them. what reason would I have to lie? All right, it's settled then. I'll introduce you to my employer and ask him to treat you. Before we leave, however, there's something else I need to take care of, and I could use a hand. The sooner we get that done, the sooner we can make for Ark. What, uh, what's Ark? Ark? Capital. The capital of this country? Yeah, I assumed as much. Walls high as towers of iron hard stone rest alone in the mountains in granite and throne. Never decaying, the ages surveying, guarded by Malthus and blah 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 and so on and so forth. Weird. Hey, you're going to see it soon. Alrighty. Um Sure. I don't really care about that Splendid. other stuff right now. You'll need some information before you can help me though. I take it uh, the fact that Vin has seen better times hasn't lot of dialogue your attention, here. has it? For the last two years, there have been wars and unrest everywhere. And even though in Enderal there is officially peace, oh, there are actually peculiar things character. happening Amazing. here too. Normally docile animals and tears attacking wanderers in the open, the dead awakening in hordes. It's unsettling. Can I loot his backpack? At least. Yes. Yes, I can. The strangest thing, however, red is madness. the red madness. God, I can't keep track of all these diseases and names and stuff, my dude. Lightborn's death. Yeah, the rumors. I I've heard oh, them that's too. Right, the Lightborn's are and the I could indeed imagine that they're true. 
connection. That there's the a connection, yes. Um, As I said, maybe. If you ask me, the Lightborn were never more than imposters anyway. False off. gods. Uh, I already know how they feel. It's blasphemy, that's what the Apothecarian said. Oh, I'm hardly representative. I've seen that a long life is only one of the things powerful magic can achieve. And the false deity theory isn't that new, after all, is it? Seriously, say the Lightborn really are as mighty as the Revelations say they are. Wouldn't they have the power to call down lightning on me right here and right now to punish me for my insolence? No. The Lightborn were immortal kings, and that's all. At least, that's how I see it. I hope I didn't hurt your feelings. Sorry about that, I had to knock at the front door. Right. Still waiting for that lightning. <laughs> We're going to get along just fine. But we digress. Red madness. Yeah. Right, I forgot it's about that. It's some kind of mental illness that makes people lose their mind. Just a couple of weeks ago, there was a smith in Ark who butchered his entire family. He was drunk. But that doesn't explain why he screamed things like fear the light while he was doing it. Or a young woman of noble path who set her own house on fire while her family was asleep. Now, you might say that these kinds of things happen, but by now there have been more than a dozen incidents in a very short period of time. The fact that the afflicted's eyes glow red while they go rampant has made people call the disease red madness. <laughs> Thing is, some weeks ago... They literally it glow dead, red. And at this Jeez. time it was a magister from the Holy Order itself. God, is that what's happening to me? The apothecary did mention my eyes were weird. A teacher who instructs the novices aspiring to become keepers? His name was Yarrow, a man with more than 60 winners on his back. God, there's a lot of exposition well, in this. According to the sole survivor, he entered the teaching room that day as usual. But instead of giving his lecture on alchemy, he gave a strange kind of speech where he kept going on about how mankind is corrupted and that it has succumbed to the void. Well, that's hardly his eyes started glowing, locked the door, to be and blew himself up in a magical explosion. Okay, yeah, well that... that's... yeah. Yes, it is. Um... What is your role? You said you had an employer that was able to heal my affliction, or whatever, or contain it. <laughs> I'm not one for vows and austerity, so no. I'm no keeper. My specialty is recovering lost things. Treasures, tomes, memories, and the like. So and the order hired me to do just that. Wait, how do you recover memories? Know how a man like Yarrow could fall victim to the Red Madness. And thus, if there's something like a pattern to this malady. You're just gonna gloss over that? You collect memories? Or does it mean he just like writes down people's stories like he did with me? Um, Doesn't matter. Right. Yarrow grew up in a small village not far from here, and according to the order, he visited it quite often after his partner died. What I want your help with is finding clues as to why he did what he did. What do you think? Uh, sure. Great. First of all, I want you to travel to Riverville and talk Go to an old man named Alfred, a childhood talk friend to of Hadville. Yarrow's. Ask him what he makes of the incident, and whether he has any explanation for it. Secondly, a farm boy told me that he saw Yarrow throw something, something into the sea during his last visit there. <coughs> Winds have been blowing inland the last couple of days, so go search the shoreline and see if it washed up. Oh, good, I was not looking at I myself going will take a look at the house Yarrow grew again. up in. Ah, and here. This is the map of the region. Yarrow's house is at the blue dot. So, unless there's anything else, I'd say let's step to it. Just meet me at the farm when you're done. Right. Okay. Anything else left here? Yeah. Anything down here? Oh, that's a path down. Which way? Oh, did I just... Oh god, I already pissed something off. Ah, die, die, die. Gotta really 
try not to get hit, seeing as it doesn't heal. Every like a little bit of health just keeps stacking up that you lose. Maybe it'd be an idea to invest in a shield. There we go, I see you. Alright. So where the hell am I then? What was my quest? Uh and the strong box, find a way to restrain the fever, gather knowledge about Enderal. Alright. So, which way are we supposed to go from here? Um, yes, I know how the world map works. Alright. It's actually quite large. Kind of, it almost looks larger than Skyrim. I'm guessing a lot of this isn't actually terrain we can go to. A lot of cities though. Oh, there's souls. Oh, right, that's there for the phasmatasmalism, uh, whatever it's called. Right, where are we? So that's where we were. That's where we got to get to. So that's where we started, okay. Damn. If they were coming from the ocean, we must have drifted all the way through here. What the hell did that happen? Right. Oh, and here's Ark. So this is the capital. Is it on a map? I wonder where the myriad towers are. We'll call that. Oh, oh, there's a um, stone on the map as well. Anyway, I think we'll call this session here before we head off. Um, yeah, so I'll see you next time.